Hey, welcome back to our Super Mario Bros. X level editor tutorial. It's time for the basics. Now today I'll be covering Auto Scroll. I wasn't planning on covering this for a few videos in at least, but I got a request by Game Master Guy to, to do Auto Scroll, so that's what I'm that's what I'm gonna do right now. So the first thing that you'll want to do is make your level. You should make your level first. I'm not sure why, but the tutorial that I looked at said that uh, it would be ideal to design your level before you do the auto scroll. So, I, if I were you, I'd follow its advice and do that. Although I'm not completely sure why you should. Now, what you're gonna want to do is go to View Events. And then it opens up this nice big old window right here. And now, over here in this section that says auto scroll, um, what you'll want to do is you'll want to set this to the section of your level that you want auto scroll. Now, in this level, this is section 3, so I will set this to section 3. Now, you want to. Well, I guess you should do this first. Okay, so after that, you'll want to um, go to your level settings, and, um, yes, right here, and you'll want to take your level boundaries option, and then um, decrease your level to one screen of size. So, you know, this is one screen because it's all that fits in this window at the time or I should say at a time. So yeah, you'll want to decrease your level to one screen by by using the the level boundaries thing. And then and then after you've done that, you'll want to see where it says section settings under position. You want to click on use current. And then that should change to set. Now that we've done that, um you want to take your level boundaries again, and then set um, set the level boundaries back to what they were originally. Now basically what this does is it tells the game where to start the auto scroll. So, so um, oh you'll also want to check this box that says auto start, because you know, you want it to start on its own. Um, and then you'll just want to set the speed, so this will be horizontal auto scroll. So I'll set the speed to say 2. And now, it should work. So, so I'll just test the level here. And, oh, still, still here. Okay, I fixed all our problems by putting a hole right here. And now, now I'll wait until, oh, go away enemies, go away, go away. Oh dear, oh dear, why did I do that? It should be right here. And now, it isn't working. What? I've seen on the internet people have been like complaining that they couldn't get auto scroll to work on a section other than the first section, like even if they set that option to the section of their level. So I guess I'll go and try it on the first section and see if it works there. Okay, I've made a new level here and I did the exact same thing I did before, um, except this section part is set to section 1 because you know it's a new level and this is section 1 so let's see if it works now yeah it works now and I did the exact same thing that I did before so I guess there is a glitch or something where auto scroll only works in the first section of a level so I guess if you want auto scroll in your level you're going to have to have it in section 1 and not any other section, so that's that's an inconvenience, I suppose. But you know, it 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 is what it is. So so yes. Um, thank you for watching. I I hope this was helpful. Any question? If you have any questions or anything, or you know, if you think I did anything wrong, feel absolutely free to tell me. I I it would be for the better if you did anyways. So yeah, thanks for watching. I'll see you later.